Welcome everybody to hey our Facebook live video and I hope you have some fun and Sans, how's your Friday? It's awesome, it's going great so far, how was your week? Yes, I had so much fun. I have to say that guys, because let's face it, some of you guys for sure saw the episode Your Mom's House uh -huh. with Tom Segura and his beautiful wife Christina and I was there on Monday and I had the blast, as, like, it was really a blast, I have to say that. I had so much fun over there. They both were so intrigued about water and it was really, really cool to see and interact with them. The coolest thing, on Wednesday, I received an email, hey, yeah, we are, we are launching the, the podcast now. And it's been launched on Spotify, Apple, and all these kind of things as a podcast. And obviously as well, now it's launched on YouTube as well. And on YouTube, it has right away 25,000 views. Wow. It's crazy. Wow. It's crazy. So many comments. I received so many emails as well about it. And it's really, really cool to see. And, and I feel really cool about it. And a lot of people said, hey, Martin, keep up. You're the real water champ. And keep up the good work <laughs> and all this kind of stuff. That's awesome. So it was really a lot of fun, I have to say. And if you haven't checked it out, you should. I listened to the podcast and they were spellbound. When it came to the water tasting, it was crazy. It was really crazy. We really had a lot of fun, I have to say that. And I, I never imagined that this would have been so much outreach as well by people. And like calling me up and sending me emails and following me on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, here on Facebook obviously as well. So it's amazing to see all this response from the people. And I'm so happy that I did this. And again, Tom Segura and wife, thank you so much for doing this with me. I had a blast and hopefully I will see you on a live show one day and we can do a water tasting, maybe even live on the show with the audience. I think that would be, be cool. kind of cool. Really that cool. would be kind of funny. How was your week? It was awesome. Just got to relax a lot. You know, it was a slow day at the restaurant, so not bad at all. Slow day at the restaurant. <laughs> it's like we had Mother's Day. <laughs> we served over 350 guests, but it's a slow day at the restaurant. It's like, it's nothing, huh? It was a lot of fun, though. Yeah, I think so. Fun. Yeah. <laughs> Anyhow, we have two waters. Guys, summer is coming. And I thought today we want to taste some waters. What is actually very available in the grocery stores. And we're tasting today Just Water and Unify Water. Two very cool brands, I have to say. I really like both of the brands. Um, and then I have very, two very unique stories mm -hmm. about two brands. Just Water is all about the environment. And you see it's a totally different packaging as well than a plastic bottle. They consider themselves like made from uh, paper in general, the whole plastic. And this is, I think, a very unique story. I know actually Jaden Smith. He's, oh, behind wow. that, he's behind the product Just Water. And I met him for half a year ago on an event. And he's a super nice guy. I have to say this. He's a super, super nice guy. So, Jaden Smith, when you see this as well, Just Water, heads up. I really love what you're doing here with this brand. I think it's a pretty cool idea. Mm -hmm. And what they're doing as well on their homepage, you can go there on justwater.com. And they're saying as well, it's so important that you're drinking spring water mm -hmm. and not filtered tap water from municipal source. What that actually means, we all know it's processed water. And they're saying it as well because they are all about the environment. They want to make sure that they're keeping the environment safe and they don't want to have too much impact on the environment. So what they have on their homepage, what is really, really cool, they have two big like charts about mm. processed water, like purified water, mm -hmm. how much energy that actually takes to filter everything out of the water. Uh, as compared to naturally. Stored, Correct. Then powerful. adding back minerals, all this kind of stuff versus a spring water where you don't barely do anything mm. to it. So it's a very interesting comparison and you should really check that out Absolutely. on Just Water homepage. Unify on the other hand, what I, it's a big pep talk to me and everybody knows this as well because I really are into this whole giving back to the community and giving back to people who do not have access to clean water. Unify says you're buying one bottle of our water and we're giving a gallon of water to a country and to people who don't have access to clean and safe drinking water. Wow, that's really cool. And that is very, very yeah, cool. Great. So I think both waters have their really amazing purposes, but now, for us both, we want to taste them. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> both are coming from a spring, and let's start with Unify. Okay. 
let's see where we go. Again, for people who may be watching us for the first time, we do not chill our water, waters down because we want to make sure that we can really taste everything out of the waters. So that's extremely important for us. So please guys, do not put ice cubes into your water. You're watering down your water with ice cubes. I know it sounds crazy, but it's actually that because ice cubes, here we go. We got here some, huh? Are mostly made of like, not really maybe the best water quality yet, but in a restaurant we have filtration systems into our systems. So our ice cubes do not smell like chlorine or something like that. So that's a nice, nice beautiful thing about it. But on a regular base, do not use crappy ice for your cocktails or for your water because you will taste like the pure yeah. taste. Cool. Shall we taste? Let's I'm do thirsty. it. Cheers, Cheers guys. Mm. What do you think, Chance? It's really, really smooth. It's super smooth. Yeah, it's, I think so. And what's the TDS on this? Because it doesn't have a really high mineral taste to it. You're absolutely right. The TDS is 79, so it's a very low mineral water. Let me go in here a little bit closer to. There we go. We are doing just water right now. The TDS level is 79. It's really light on the palate as well. Yeah, it comes from upstate New York. I like the water. Huh? It's a very easy, easy to like water. Too. But I have to say, it doesn't have this really refreshing taste mm -hmm. to it. So yeah. it's a water what lingers in your palate, mm -hmm. but there's not really this wow, refreshing taste. Yeah. Obviously, that depends a little bit as well because we don't chill the water down. But again, some waters with a little higher mineral content feels more yeah. refreshing in your Absolutely. palate. And this is again about a soup like with no salt. And here at Patina Restaurant, we have amazing chefs who are creating beautiful dishes with the team of Andreas Roller and it is really like that that a soup without salt is not really tasty mm -hmm. and this is the same with waters a water with almost no minerals like distilled water are super tasteless and very boring yeah. in your palate yeah. therefore it's not really yummy to drink guys mm -hmm. but here you know, uh, just water I think it's a very nice water to drink Absolutely. on a daily basis. It's yeah. very easy to drink. Good job, Justin. It's Here really interesting too, because some of the lower TDS waters that I taste, it kind of feels like it dries out in your palate as mm. well when you taste it, but this doesn't have that effect. As Correct, much I think so too. Because still, 79 TDS means there's way yeah. more minerals in it than in purified waters. Yeah. Purified waters on a regular base have a TDS level of between 20 and 40 TDS. Mm -hmm. So we're talking almost the double yeah. of the mineral content, electrolyte content, what purified water is telling you to, to have. Mm -hmm. And this is again, purified waters, and you see it on the labels, added electrolytes. And everybody's like, yeah, <laughs> electrolytes, I need electrolytes, I need electrolytes. Yes, you need electrolytes, it's absolutely right. But that's the tricky part, the purified water companies don't really tell you how much electrolytes are in there. And this is again, this much. Mm. It's like literally yeah. barely anything into the waters. And here, natural occurring spring waters, most of them have way more minerals than purified waters. Mm. Okay, the next water we're tasting Unify. Unify water from Kentucky. So both American brands. Cheers, cheers, cheers guys. It feels colder in your palate, mm -hmm. right away. That's interesting. So we are doubling now the TDS level of just water. Just water again, 79 TDS. Unify, 151. I think it's smooth as well. Mm -hmm. It's not that smooth like just water. Just yeah, water was like super not, velvety yeah. on your palate. Yeah. It's not quite as smooth, but it has a, a little more taste to it as yeah. well, for sure. I think so, too. Do you like it? I do. I like it a lot. Mm -hmm. I like it, too. It's a very good mouthfeel. Mm. 
It has, again, like this little bit more refreshing aspect to it, what I really love in water. It doesn't dry out your palate, the same like with, with just water, because that's always a problem, what Jorjens has said. Sometimes like waters can be very like dry in your palate, mm -hmm. so that's pretty cool. I think they're both great products. I love both of them, and I really love the story behind them both. Yeah, the missions are really cool. Correct. Their missions are amazing, and this is again like what I think is amazing. And we have sometimes people who say like, hey Martin, um, it's kind of ridiculous that you're tasting different waters and then so many other people don't have access to clean and safe drinking water. And you're absolutely right. It is crazy that we have here in America the possibility to drink so many different waters, but I think we should be lucky for that. And that's the reason companies like Unify, they're really taking it to the next step and they want to start to help people in countries who do not have access to clean water. Absolutely. And you can see it on my home page as well, water.org. I'm a big fan of them, the Matt Damon people mm -hmm. behind it to support uh, safe drinking water to countries who do not have, have safe and clean drinking water. And it's very, very important for me that we always talk this. And I have to say, when you buy a Unify water, for example, you're helping actually people in other countries versus when you're using your tap water. I never saw that the Department of Water and Power sent a check over to Africa to get clean drinking water. Let's face that. So you're actually helping guys by buying this kind of products to people in countries who do not have access to clean and safe drinking water. And that is amazing, amazing for me. What's really cool about uh, water source from springs as well, or I guess natural source water, is that all of these companies are very environmentally aware when it comes to protecting the water sources that, they, that they get their products from. And so when you put money into that, then you're putting money into these people conserving those areas as Absolutely well, which is right. also really cool. Absolutely right. And I think this is a great topic to say, what, what Trent just said, it's absolutely right. And I've been to many, many springs already, and it's very interesting to see this, that a lot of springs are really into the whole environment and their nature and the impact what's happening in their nature, because they want to make sure that the spring stays clean and safe. And therefore, they're really into protecting the whole areas where the spring is located. And that helps, again, Mother Nature as well. And this is, again, it's a product of nature. This is the beauty about water tastings and, and having different waters in your glass because we should honor Mother Nature all the time to have amazing, different, cool waters in our glass that we can drink them. And let's face it, guys, it's the most healthiest beverage on this planet. Zero calories, zero sugar, uh, nothing's been added, nothing has been ripped out of these waters. This is Mother Nature in your glass. And this is not processed food. This is actually a healthy food. Mm -hmm. And I love to hear this, and I love to cheer to this. Cheers, guys. Anyhow, I wish you all the best. It's Friday. We will be very busy at the Tina restaurant today, tomorrow, and Sunday. When you want to taste some waters with us, Chance and myself are here mostly on a daily basis. Just stop by here at the Tina restaurant in the Walt Disney Concert Hall, and we will go all love to see you guys. Absolutely. Huh? Stay thirsty. And again, water is not just water, guys. Have a great day. Cheers, guys. Cheers.